Hello, can you tell who I am? If not, I am Jim Thorpe. I was born May 28, 1887 in Prague, Oklahoma. As a child, I had 11 brothers and sisters. Sadly, only six made it. I was known for my athletic ability. I played on a number of different professional baseball and football teams. In 1912, I even completed in, competed in the Olympics, where I won multiple gold medals, both stripped of them because I played minor league baseball for money. Some people refer to me as the greatest athlete of all time. Others didn't fe treat me equally because I was a Native American. I didn't want to see me, they didn't want to see me succeed. Later in life, I found a purpose in fighting for my people. I died in Lamada, California on March 28, 1853 from a heart attack. Shigeru Miyamoto. I was born on November 16, 19, I mean, yeah, 1952. As a child, I loved to explore areas around my house, like to wander into caves, which later inspired me to create an award-winning video game. In fact, lots of my experiences led to creating games. We'll get to that later, though. With my, some of my free time as a child, I liked to participate in puppet shows. I attended Kanazawa Municipal College of Industrial Arts and Crafts and graduated in 1977. I got an interview and became an employee at Nintendo where the boss was good friends with my dad, Liz Jake. I became one of the best employees at Nintendo. I led Nintendo to many successes. Almost everything went great in my life. I am now recognized as one of the first four honorary citizens of my hometown, Nantan City, Kyoto. My name is Jane Goodall. I was born on April 3rd, 1934 in London, England. My parents are Mortimer and Margaret my family. Morris Goodall. Growing up, I loved animals, just like I do now. When I was just over one year old, my dad got me a toy chimpanzee in honor for a chimpanzee born at the London Zoo. I love animals. As a kid, I went to a private school called Uplands Private School. My nickname is the Chimpanzee, La Chimpanzee Lady because I love chimpanzees. I'm a primatologist most known for my long-term study of wild chimpanzees in Tanzania. 
I faced the lack of college education, which made many scientists that received my work not find it credible. When I was in Africa, four researchers were kidnapped by local rebels. One of my major contributions to the field of primatology was the discovery of tool making and chimpanzees. I've also discovered that some chimpanzees alter pieces of grass or twigs and poke them into termite mounds and the termites will grab on with man with their man mandibles and the chimpanzee will pull the twig or grass blade out and eat the termites. Here are some fun facts about me. I'm the world's mo I'm the world's foremost expert in chimpanzee chimpanzees and I was first introduced to chimpanzees when I was a baby. I'm still alive right now. I'm eighty six years old. Bye. Bonjour. My name is Georges de Mesta. I was born June 19, 1907 in Colombia, Switzerland. As a kid, I liked to build things. In fact, at the age of 12, I received my first patent for a toy airplane I created. I worked odd jobs to pay my way through college. I went to École Polytechnique Federal de Lausanne and earned my degree in electrical engineering. In 1941, I came up with an idea while I was doing something I loved to do, hiking with my dog. As I was hiking, I noticed a lot of burrs on my dog's fur in my pants. So I went home and looked at them under a microscope and saw a whole bunch of tiny hooks on the burrs and loops on my pants and dog's fur. When I, and that's when I got the idea of inventing a new type of fastener, Velcro. At first, I didn't have the right material. Nylon worked better than cotton, and, I, and then I didn't have the right size of hooks and loops. It took more than two decades for my idea to finally stick. And then I... Then I finally got it right, and Velcro was complete. I died on February 8, 1990, in Communique, Switzerland, from acute bronchitis. In 1999, I was inducted into the National Inventors Hall of Fame. Velcro changed the way people attach things, and it is used in every field of work. Hi, I died when I was 15. Can you guess who I am? Well, I am Anne Frank. And I love to write diaries. It was one of the things I did while I was hiding from the Nazis. I died February 1945, and I died at 15. And I went into hiding on July, 4, July 1942. We had to walk barefoot. We lived in an attic, and we had to whisper so quiet so they would not find us. But when they did, we all died. And only and the only one who survived is my father. This is my story. What is yours? Hi, I am Will Chamberlain. I was born August 21st, 1936 in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I had nine brothers and sisters. I went to Overbrook High School. I had a lot of nicknames. They are Dipper, the Big Dipper, Will, the Stilt, and the Stilt. I was six foot eleven in high school. In high school, I would dunk free throws, but the NBA banned dunking free throws. During my career, I suffered a fractured wrist, and I was the first NBA player to score more than thirty thousand points during my professional career. I died in nineteen ninety nine because of a heart failure. Hello, I'm John R. Cash. I was born February 26, 1932 in Kingsland, Arkansas. I have three sisters, Joanne Cash, Reba Cash, and Margaret Louise Cash. And I have three brothers, Tommy Cash, Roy Cash, and Jack Cash. And my parents are Ray Cash and Carrie Clovery. I like to play guitar and perform. One of my famous songs I played was Ring of Fire. My nicknames are JR and Man in Black. I am known for my country music. I use my earnings to support mental health associations. I got into car accidents because of my addiction. I fanned off roads and hid in caves. I was often moody and hard to work with, but I was compassionate, creative, 
and humble. I died September 12, 2003 from diabetes in Tennessee. My name is Rosa Park. I was born on February 4th, 1913 in Tuskia, Alabama. I was an African-American. I grew up with my parents, James McClure and Leon Edward. Edwards. My, I was homeschooled until I was 11 years old. When I was younger, I got sick a lot, so I was very small. I was a civil rights activist who refused to surrender my seat to a white passenger on the segregation bus in Montgomery, Alabama. My, de my defiance sparked the Montgomery bus boycott. Its successes launched nationwide effects to end racial segregation of the public felicity felicities. I was arrested for standing up for myself. I was a civil rights fighter. I died on October 24th, 2005 in Detroit, in Detroit, Michigan. My name is Henry Ford. I was born in, on July 30th, 1863 in Rio Greenfield, Michigan. On my family's farm, my friends called me Crazy Henry. Growing up, I helped my family by running a sawmill. And in 1888, I married Clara Albrian, and we had our only son, El. Ellis, Ellis, in 1893, in 1893, I went to work for the Detroit Edison Company as an engineer. By 1903, I opened my own Ford motor company. I introduced my first Model T. In 1980, I died on April, April 17th, 1947 from a stroke. Still today, people are able to purchase boards. Hi, I'm Amelia Earhart. I was born July 24th, 1897 in Atchison, Kansas. I have a father and a sister. My mother I knew nothing about. I spent most of my time playing and doing everything with my sister. When I was little, I was not interested in flying around the world. When I grew, I wanted to be almost the first woman to fly. I enjoyed flying until my disappearance in 1937 while I was attempting to fly around the world. Hi, my name is Muhammad Ali and I'm a famous boxer. I was born on January 17, 1942 in Louisville, Kentucky. My birth name was Cassius Marcellus Clay Jr. I began training when I was 12 years old. My first trainer was Joe Martin. When I grew up, I became a professional boxer. I was the first world heavyweight champion. On three separate occasions, I was the leading heavyweight boxer. I opened the Muhammad Ali Center in my hometown in hopes that it would inspire pe people to be the best they can be in respect of one another. In 19 
1984, I was diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. I established the Muhammad Ali Parkinson Center in Phoenix, Arizona. My daughter Layla was a boxer and she got 21 knockouts and 24 wins and no losses. I got 56 wins and 61 matches. Every barrier people put up in front of me, I overcame. I proved that Muslims and African Americans can accomplish their dreams and goals. I simply believe we should push toward our goals. I died in Scottsdale, Arizona on June 3rd, 2016. Fly like a butterfly, sting like a bee. Hi, my name is Elizabeth Caddy Stanton. I was born in November 12, 1815 in Jonestown, Pennsylvania, to Daniel Caddy and Margaret Livingston. I lived in Jonestown when I married Henry Stanton in 1840 and later had seven children. I went to Troy Female Seminary School while she was while I was there, I had a breakdown, so that is why why I didn't like organization religion. I like to fight for women's rights. I was an Afri American leader in the women's rights movement movement in 1848 at the Sinsa Falls Convention I drafted the first organized demand for women's right suffer suffrages in the United States I changed the social and political landscape of the United States by succeeding in in my work to genuine rights of the women and slaves. I had to overcome women not having the same rights as men. I died on October 26, 1902, at the age of 86. Hi, my name is Sam Walton. I was born on March 29, 1918 in Kingfisher, Oklahoma. I created Walmart and Slams Club because I wanted people to be able to find everything they needed in one convenient location at affordable prices. The very first Walmart was located in Rogers, Arkansas. Today, there are approximately 11,500 11, stores in 25, 27 countries. They, they employ approximately... 2.2 million associates around the world around the world 1.5 million in the u.s alone walmart stores incorporated to be the world's largest corporation by revenue as well as the biggest private employer in the world for for a period of time i was the richest man in america i died april 5th 1992. Hi, my name is Audrey Hepburn. I was born May 4th, 1929 in Brussels, Belgium. My parents were A.J. Hepburn and Elevate Hamster. I attended school in Eagleland. I was married twice and had two sons whose name was Cena and Luca. I'm known today because I was a fashion icon and won many Academy Awards for Best Actress. Later in my life, I became a Goodwill and, and Belsner for you and ICEF where I traveled the world. 
to have children. I died January 20, 1993 from appendix cancer. My name is John Deere. I was born February 7, 1804 in Ruthland, Vermont. I was a blacksmith by trade for 12 years. In 1837, I left my job as a blacksmith and moved to Illinois. There, I set up another blacksmith shop. When I was working as a blacksmith, I was fixing all the same problems on, a, on plows. After that, I came up with an idea to invent my own plow. And in 1838, I invented the first plow, and the next year I made 10 plows. And the year after that, I had made 40. In 1868, Deer and Company was found. I then settled in Moline, Illinois. I was the mayor for two years. I died at home on May 7th. 17th, 1886 at the age of 82.